As we're starting off our day, we do have a chill in the air. You want to dress warm for the first few hours of the day. 43 now, our temperature with a north breeze, about 10 miles per hour, putting us with a wind chill into the 30s. So not the warmest out the door, but we will warm up into the mid 60s for our temps. By the time we get to the afternoon, have less wind at that point, and there's a lot to like about how the afternoon goes. If you're heading to Friday night fever games, we'll cool off in a hurry, and we'll be heading toward a likely frost as we get toward tomorrow morning. The good news is no more of that in the forecast. That full 10 day forecast shows a big jump in the temps by Monday and Tuesday. Six first little weather days for fire risk and strong winds that are in place both of those days. All right, more top stories before you go this morning. One of four men involved in an Omaha public corruption scandal last year is out of prison early. Vinnie Palermo spent nearly 18 months behind bars. The scandal involved taking money from a charity and abusing public office. A Nebraska woman taking legal action against McDonald's. She says she ate a quarter pounder and ended up in the ER. Clarissa DeBach is now suing the fast food chain. It is the second lawsuit to be filed against McDonald's in the last two days over that growing E. coli outbreak. Now, according to the complaint, she is still recovering from her symptoms. Public hearings today on Nebraska's ballot measures this afternoon will focus on paid sick leave and medical marijuana. More hearings tomorrow will tackle abortion and the scholarship referendum. All hearings are at the Thompson Alumni Center on UNO's campus. And some important election deadlines for you to keep in mind. Today is the last day Nebraskans can register to vote. You can register in person at your election commission. Today is also your last chance to request an early ballot to be mailed. And we wrap up our regular season of Friday Night Fever tonight. Here are some of the games we'll be covering. First up, our game of the week. That's Millard West and West View. Then we have Lincoln Southwest at Omaha North. And finally, Elkhorn North versus Bennington. Of course, we'll have highlights of these games and more later tonight live at 10. All right, here's a look at what's going on in the Metro this weekend. It is Hello Weekend at the Durham Museum. Children 12 and under get in free and costumes are encouraged. Saturday is the Witchy Woods Walk. That's at the Hitchcock Nature Center in Iowa. It's from 2 to 4.30 p.m. And finally, of course, the Oscars take on number four Ohio State. Everybody say a prayer. You can watch it on Fox. Kickoff is set at 11 a.m.